Hello everyone, Shadow Dragon has been improved, and I am playing that improved version of Mecha. Joined once again by Raisins for some Trader's Worth. How are you doing today? Doing all right. I don't actually know the whole Trader's Worth thing. I think uh, before we were starting the map, you were like really keen on looking at your gold balance or something. <laughs> like, I don't know, what were, you, what were you trying to do? I was, I was complaining about forge? being broke for forges, but uh, we got a bully on L last chapter, I think. So I sold that. Ah. And now we're that rich. If... We're, we're hella rich. We can force whatever we oh, want. Oh, I see, I see. I was about to say, if we get a trader, could we sell them? I mean, like, surely we could figure out how much a trader's worth, right? Like, <laughs> yeah. because, you know. Yeah, if you're curious about that, because you've never seen the guidance chapter that we're in, which I wouldn't blame you for, uh, it's just regular old chapter 12x, I think just like 6x in vanilla, you have to kill all but 14 or 15 members of your army to access this chapter, and you get a nice big general for your composition. Uh, no different here, no one replaced Horus, so it's just going to be... Business as usual, except of course with units mm -hmm. that we're using. Yeah, look uh, at this yeah. guy, by the way. He's like really, I don't know, he's just very dashing. He's very know. dashing, yes. In FE12, yeah. In FE12, he's like not a guy in character. He just joins you. So actually, no, he's in Gaiden, but it's a very easy to get Gaiden. So you basically always get him, and he's just as dashing there. Uh, that's fair, that's fair. And, uh, he's not terrible. I think our Gatri beats him, though. <laughs> like all the stats that matter a lot. Yeah, so, pretty much. I don't think we have a grand purpose for him. He's, he's pretty cool. I like the the guiding chapters, uh, guiding characters design, I should say. Also, mm -hmm. you might have noticed that the enemies have steel weapons again instead of uh, forges and silvers, so it's a bit easier. Really? They're also fairly low level, so I brought the B team once again. And there the you go. We can do it. The B team being um, Akaya. It's kind of <laughs> it's kind of a Tellius team. Akaya, Ike. Uh, Geese kind of reprises his role until he gets C axis finally. Uh, Wolf used the Parthia base because it's A rank bow, so I gave him that. Parthia and Parthia and Longbow. Bartray's back. Titania gonna get her debut, her proper debut this chapter. She's gonna be really good. I think she doubles every enemy in this chapter. They all have like 10 speed. Uh, Nime's back from the bench. Altena's here. There's like one mana key that I need someone with some durability and speed to take care of. That's why Rutger's here. Queen is here to maybe get some more level ups. I don't know. I don't have no master suits for her, unfortunately. And Nino, Nino is at that point, Raisins, where, you know, remember when we said, oh, the enemies have like about 10-ish speed, so we need to get someone to 14 speed with the speed wing. Mm -hmm. I think I might have found a candidate. If Nino, I think, doesn't get a speed level next le next level, we might just give her the speed wing, and then she can double everything. That's right, just ship it. Like, I, I, I get it. She's right there, so you might as well give it a go. Yeah. Right? Let's just see, see if she can make it without the speed wing. It's not like the chapter is super, like... I mean, I don't want to say the chapter's like super easy, but like the chapter's super easy, right? <laughs> I mean, come on, like let's, it's let's pretty easy. It's pretty easy. I'm, I'm glad you brought geese because when I saw this chapter, th this is my first time seeing this chapter ever, by the way. <laughs> but, but when I saw this chapter, I'm like, this is just an upside down version of chapter 10A from the Binding Blade. Right? Yeah, like, with the pirates the reinforcements. Yeah, I mean, if you flip right. it, like it depends on how you flip it, right? Because if you flip it, like in what's it called? Vertical flip means the four the force would still be on the same side, but if you did That's like. Right. If you turned it around like an 180 degree angle, then mm -hmm. they would be on the other side. Exactly. Yeah, if you just like, if this were a piece of paper, if you just grabbed it with two hands from the bottom and just like went whoosh and just like yeah. moved it up to the top, then yeah, you'd get chapter 10A. Or you'd just get a blank piece of paper that didn't put a map <laughs> on the other side, I guess, right? Like, man. With a blank piece of paper, it would be a bit hard to tell what you do. Exactly. Yeah, it'd be Thracer chapter 2X, mm -hmm. right? Like, there you go. Nice. Um, My better question so. for you would be. Uh, usually in this game you give Marth the boots because he spends the most time walking from one place to another and it makes sense to give him the boots. Uh, but on the other hand, you know, we're not really going super fast anyway. Usually we're fighting at a slower pace than Marth can move, so maybe we give someone else the boots? Well, I think uh, giving Marth the boots is pretty good because we are deploying them every map, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I do think we are, you know, j just just for fun, deploying or undeploying a lot of people. Like, I would love the boots to go on Rosado, for example, right? Yeah. I mean, like, this seems like the clear choice here. Uh huh. And, and you, you know, usually what I do is just, with, with the boots in literally any Fire Emblem game, including this one, is I just put it on the unit who's, like, has the highest move already and is doing a lot of the combat. Yeah. You know, usually just my biggest wyvern or my biggest paladin Same. gets the boost. It would be Rosado, but Rosado isn't going to be in every chapter. It's going to be in most chapters. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, too, I mean, like, okay, if it really comes down to it, you know, if the rubber hits the road and we're like, man, we need movement, we got, like, warp stabs. <laughs> so, like, yeah, you know, how bad is it going to be? Right, I think we get, like, what, 100-something warp stabs in this game or, like, 90-something warp stabs in this game. Yeah. It's quite ridiculous. <laughs> We've used a fair amount in, like, chapter 10, uh, but we're going to get... I think I just got a new one from chapter 12. Uh, this one. So now we have oh, yeah, there we stuff go. right now. So we, we do have a fair amount for sure. That's right. We're okay. currently positive on warp stabs, right? So, yes. you know. Our, our budget on warp stabs is looking great right now. All right. 
Okay, uh, my plan for this chapter is to... Oh, first of all, we need to promote someone. We need to promote Makaya. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's my plan. There you go. Promote Makaya. Get some Thaney in there. Let's do it. I can tell you right now, Makaya with Thaney can exactly one-shot the Armonite right in front of us. Wait, but, seriously? Yeah, but this is a Guidance chapter, and these are a bit weaker, so maybe we forge like, a little bit of Might onto it. Just, uh, you know, because we have the money, and that way we can one-shot Paladins for something later. We have the money, Cotty? <laughs> the money, Cotty. It is a very expensive force. Like, even plus three is already, like, a fourth of our cash. But, like, oh, right. it's, it's gonna well, be... Well, we gotta just, like, call it the money, Cotty, then, right? So, you know. <laughs> the money, Cotty. <laughs> I was... I... I had another name in mind. I think the Thaney is such a cool tome. I don't think I want, I want to call it like I should have saved that for like a sword or something. Oh, okay, about, sure, yeah, yeah. But I'm gonna keep that one in mind because I do really like Monty Cotty. I was thinking the Thanatos. The Thanatos. Yes, it's huh. like Thanatos, the god of death. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. I was like, what the heck's that a reference to? Like mythology? Yes. What else? Yeah. Like, okay. I mean, I've been doing memes all along, so don't blame me for not expecting the Greek mythology, Spanish Inquisition. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, I was like, what the heck is it? You're going to tell me it's like some Patreon meme with like you and your buddies playing Secret Taylor or something. Right? Like, <laughs> there we go. Anyway. Yo, uh, one of these guys is recruitable, right? So. <laughs> yeah, only one. He's yeah. uh, He blackmailed your horse into fighting for these guys. So yeah, really? so Thanitos, it's a, it's a massive one shot now. We could do this. Either. We could do that. Or what we can do is give it to Bartre. And give Makai the Cavalier. We could do like uh, I had an idea for this. Hold up. Oh, she's too far oh, away. We need to see the uh, the the Titania axe animation, right? Oh yeah, no. oh yeah, that's yeah, definitely but... gonna happen. Let me double check her All animations right. are on. They're on. Okay, so Titania, I fully expect her to not have an animation, but let's yeah. see it. Time to what? pierce this mystery. Oh. <laughs> just... There we go. I knew it. It's an it. axe. Trust me, it's an axe. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, funny axe you got there. <laughs> just enough. This is enough. All right, let's go, Bartre. There you go. She, she's just creative. That's what it is, right? You know. <laughs> that's her, good. In her weapon choices. <laughs> I like that so much for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. Uh, so yeah, Makaya can... Oh, she doesn't one-shot. Wait, she doesn't get up there. No. All right, he's... Awful. We just stole her kill. What the heck, man? No. Oh, she'll have to get a different kill then. Okay, in that case... Oh, they can't cross this, uh, this river. There's, like, no enemies here. We're wiping them out. We're wrecking them. I don't know. I was expecting, out. like, you know, if this really were 10A, there'd be, what, another, like, 13 mercenaries left, right? So. <laughs> See, there's some guy here. You can't reach us. There's, you said there's pirates from the forts, but not right now, I'm assuming. Oh, yeah. Let me... Bro, you're, you're never going to believe this. Turn 8? It's like... Yeah, it's like turn 8. <laughs> <laughs> good, Anakin. Good. Like, I don't know. That... that... You guys will see them like next episode or something. All right, like, come on. <laughs> all right hit him up, geese. Do you get two shot? Nope. Okay, he's gonna take a close. Get that axe rank, boy. Get that experience. Yeah. I wonder if this guy Oko is Makaya. Twenty three. It's like nope. Doesn't even Oko Makaya. Good job, Makaya. You, Titania. This is like the first time I'll play through where there's been just like one enemy and yeah. you gang up on him with like three guys and nobody dies. <laughs> like, <laughs> no one involved dies. I guess yeah. I'll send Marth to the outer perimeter because the middle's so busy and he's like, okay, are we can this guy for someone. We'll have like, you know, tag along and I don't know, maybe one more sword person, like a Rutger. I don't know. Then we'll send Athena right. to the middle or, I mean, Athena's replacement, Queen, Ike. The they Guidance Chapter Squad, that's they right. They gotta heal. Volt gonna shoot someone. Next who, turn. who recruits Horus? It's, it's Marth, right? Uh, I think you just have to beat the chapter without him dying. Oh, right. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, and he doesn't even move. That's kind of funny. So, well, he will move if you attack him. Or rather, if you get okay. in his range. Uh, so... You keep we, changing the rules on me. What the heck? He's like, <laughs> it doesn't move. Unless you attack him. Organ is rage. It's like, so he moves. <laughs> <laughs> like, he doesn't move from tough. the start. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put it that way. Oh, Mage is yeah. coming. coming. Mage is coming. Okay, so th these guys move. To be fair, yeah. yeah. They don't... Yeah, Horus doesn't do that. That thing we just saw. Mm -hmm. Oh, come on, Nino, dude. Uh, okay, so Eleven Sword into Nino, I guess. And Marth just maybe river walks around him. I don't know. Walks backwards and gets healed. And then just makes up for it. Bypasses the, the guy. Yeah, because I think he dies to this guy. Right now. He, no way. Oh, 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 my God. Wait, does no the mage gets doubled? Oh, Marth you're right. doubles the mage. I'm yeah, other way around. I'm Doomy. 
Um, do you mean? Do you know? Domo. Alright, let's just go backwards and then kill the Nino. Go, Nino! No! Yes! <laughs> Uh, right? Yeah. I mean, does, doesn't Altena do something about that mage, or no? The mage? Oh, yeah, Altena. The yeah, Altena is yeah, not... Yeah. No, that's not the wyvern with Rez. I left both of those at home, unfortunately. Well, what are we going to do about the mage? I mean, I guess... Like, I mean, he doesn't kill Nino, right? Because oh, true. 21. Yeah, doesn't kill Nino. Just yeah, got the heck, yo, she has Rez. Yep. Alright. Here you go. That's the, the other stuff. mage. Nice. All right, so close to the level up. If we chip, if she, if the mage chips Nino, then we're we will know if she has that speed level up. Mm -hmm. Heal Marf, and then I mean, I, I really am itching to try out the Tiny Toes, but right now, I see a kill for Ike. We can find like every better excuse to do everything else, right? <laughs> but, like that's the thing with promoting the staff user, right? It's like if you promote the staff user, and then you keep the same number of staff users, it's like man, I just kind of want to like heal people with this Makaya thing. Yeah. <laughs> sure. I mean, I'm just... The next guy that comes at me with full health and armor weakness or standing weakness is going to get toasted. I promise you that. It's just it's going to be a little bit... I think That's Horus's right. group might move separately, so... It's going to get Thanny toasted? I don't know. Yeah. Right. Uh, free chip? It's literally free damage. <laughs> They're just handing it out. Uh -huh. There you go. Uh, let's see how that AI works here. This archer might be separate from Horus's group, so let's have Titania have a go with her hand axe. And how Volt's going to fun with a six speed. And I don't know where Altena goes. Can she just get some fort healing this turn? Nope, doesn't look like it. Yeah, I think oh, she can get some fort kinda... healing, like, you know, next turn. Yeah, I guess we could I... do that. But Mikaya's right here already, so we might as well just do this, I think. Is there... say, as long as she gets her fort healing by, like, turn seven, right? We should be fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking about sending her down there at some point, but I, w I think she would not take insignificant damage from the pirates. I think she would take significant damage from pirates. Mm -hmm. But maybe Queen could help out there. Good damage. 13. Oh, wait. It's actually doubles. Am I wrong? Did we just not do the math? I don't know. Hmm. I could swear they had 10 speed and Zany has 14. There's not like a getting weighed down issue, right? Like, no we're, way. Okay. We're at the point where nobody's getting weighed down by anything, right? Like, Except like I think mages just... by heavy tomes. Yeah, let's see. No, we find the one 11 speed enemy in the map. This one is it's 11. Yeah. These have 9. 11. Okay, actually, they're 10 to 11 speed, so you know, needs even more stunks than I thought. Okay. Okay. We discovered it. Okay, so there is All some 11 speed, but it was not the thing of being weighed down by a paltry hand axe, fortunately. Maybe you, like, you made those plans and when, when we reset to do the intro. Because, like, I, I mean, when, when you see that we are, like, doing the intro, we literally are just rebooting the game and, like, yeah. putting it back up again so we get the screen. And then there's just every enemy rolled high, like, yeah. just despite Nino. A lot of them right. did. Uh, I think Walt can get this, actually, with the Parthia. 24 attack. So. Yeah, you get doubled this. EXP weekend? Yeah, <laughs> he also gets doubled, by the way, but, you know, he just don't okay. miss, well, I guess. I mean, um, EXP gets doubled, he gets doubled, we have the same point, you know. I don't think EXP gets doubled with Parthia on this game, right? With Parthia? Wait, really? It doesn't say so. I, I know it's the case in FE3. Uh, let's I see. Could, I could open it up on Serenes. We could solve this. If it doesn't say it, it probably doesn't, right? Yeah, but, you know, I don't think so. What if? Let's see, so that Imagine, reaches up right? to the bridge. What about this guy? I think he reaches even further. Okay, so Titania can go like beyond the bridge a little bit. Like, go here. That's right. Do this and just Irvin, this guy. Of course, I for I could was really for Titania. I fooled you all. I did look it up, and yeah, it does not give double DXP in this game. It has the, uh, like, y you can use it as a pure water. Oh, yeah, that's, that's got the funny that. part. All right, go Wolt! Parthia! <laughs> Big XP. Exploded. Only 50 XP again. Oh, oh, we got strength. You know what? But we got strength in one set that matters, right? I will take it. And the archer honestly, arguably does matter the most. I'm here. Uh, did the cab run away? He did run away. He's like, no, I'm not getting that. I'm not getting humiliated by geese like that. Mm -hmm. uh, Unfortunately, no. we've been kind of checkmated by this mage positioning. Yeah, well, checkmate this. Unless. Whoa, we Uno reversed it. <laughs> Wait, we just one shot. Okay. Yo, hold on. This Nino unit is kind of good. I mean, he was weakened, but yeah. <laughs> by Nino, speed, right? Speed, I don't know. Speed, no, by, by Rutgers Leffen Sword. <laughs> um, Steel Lance no 23. Way. Nino survives, so we can do the same trick again. Actually, I think we oh, will hit okay. into Rutger next turn. But it's, that's, that's right. good too. That's good too. Nino survives. 
Maybe even Does Marth. Survive, maybe, maybe, yeah, Rutgers off HP. Maybe Marth can kill from here? With a rapier? From here? He has a boots. Oh, he has the boots. Yeah. That's true. Get in there. Oh, yeah. See, this is the real reason why I put boots on Marth. It's actually <laughs> for combat carry Marth. Trust me, guys. <laughs> this turn, it'll happen. Yeah, eventually. this turn. All right, uh, yeah, not even this run. This turn, actually. <laughs> this turn is going to turn into the Marth run. This exact turn. All right, there's another Cav here. I might as well bait him with uh, Altina while she has nothing to do while making progress mm -hmm. here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Look, you look at that. Boots Marth is just literally perfect right now. Oh, my goodness, man. Okay, so we'll bait him with Altina and kill with Nino. Perfection. Decent involve too, why not? It's got nothing it's to good do to anyway. Me. Give him the brave axe, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Get doubled. <laughs> Missed twice. The usual. That's right. You know, pe people really clown on the brave axe accuracy in FE6, but I don't know, man. Like, it, it attacks twice. That's got to be worth something. I mean, yeah, right? If the enemy dies as a result, for sure. If they don't. More chances to, more chances to hit. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. More chances okay. to miss. Uh, Golly, you, you really glass are just like a glass full. half empty person. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, it looks like Geese would get wrecked by two mages, I think, if he goes here. Although they might only have one square. If yeah, actually, these two mages are like kind of, mm, kind of. They kind of murder everyone who comes near, and I does Altina not kill them? Yeah, she does. Kind of. I mean, I guess we could kill one and physic her. Is there yeah, like in the other order, right? But. Because she also gets just killed on the counter, doesn't she? Right now, yeah, yeah. She would have to get healed twice, probably, actually, because... Hmm. Yeah, it's a lot. So probably Physic with both uh, Nime and Mikaya on Altena to kill both mages, or kill one mage, and then Marth plus Rutger plus Geese kills this Cav, hopefully, question mark? Because Nino's on a range to fight the Cav, actually. So, I do I remember which one moved first? I actually have no recollection of which one moved first of the two mages. Uh, that shouldn't matter, right? As long as the cab dies. I guess we could save points with like, yeah, you're right, you're or something right. and then just figure it out. Yeah, I was saying, like, does it matter? I was, I was wondering if there was, like, some move order, get them to attack a guy in the back and then get them to attack a guy in the front type thing we could do, but if we don't know the move order, I don't think that can even mm -hmm. work anyway. Okay, let's Physic with Mikaya on Alpino. And then kill one mage, I guess the closest one. Then we'll get down to 23. So I have to heal like 13 to get back up. But we saved our bigger I think physic. So. I think. I think Mikaya's like insane magic too though. 18. Yeah, they have like the same magic, funnily enough. Wow. Okay, insane. Nime goes here. Heal attain up to 28. Beautiful. Oh, that's plenty. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So now all we need to do is like hit this cab. 15. 15. I think we got enough damage between these two alone. Yeah, yeah. I'd better try to feed the geese, but if I can't, then I will feed the Marth instead. Yeah, it looks like... I, I think geese has to chip here. I don't yeah. think Marth is able to do it. I think you're right. Unless we somehow get the... What's it called? The Rapier River? The Forge one, the Regal Blade. Yeah, that would be complicated because I already used this turn, and there's no Convoy there, so... Oh, true. We should have thought that. Let's just hit the Hand Axe, I think, because if he attacks the Cav and gets countered... He gets put to 20, no, 19. That There's no way he survives the mage. Yeah, yeah. no. Same 19, yeah, get out of here. All right. Uh, we see the river doesn't give any avoid. The village gives him like, five avoid, so I guess. Ah, I'm just going to throw him here, because then way Marth can visit first if we need, if we want that. Nice. That's right. See axes finally? Dude, God, he's so close. You saw, I saw the bar move. I don't know if you saw it. <laughs> You saw that, like you actually just saw the bar advance and move. Yes, oh, like goodness. a little bit, like a very tiny little bit. All right, I guess it's like teasing us there. Oh, oh, the Marth run is happening. I'm telling you, the stats eventually. Okay, uh, we got a pair of calves. I think. Oh, that's right. Horse said like, hey, if you don't, if you don't come, if you don't come too close, and don't, then don't move for them. Mm -hmm. But how close is too close? Yeah, that's you know. a good question because apparently in calf range is not close enough. Hmm. I mean, we did use the save point, so I, I guess what we can do is like put Titania in range of like a lot of things, however much she can survive, and see what happens then. Fourteen. Sounds alright. I think that's around like four enemies. Nine. I think she cannot take two armor knights, or she can take two armor knights, but not two armor knights and a cav. 
Yeah, no, the, the four defense bonus is like pretty wimpy. It's not like we can just pop ourselves there and, you know, forget about it. Yeah, plus that's in range of horse, who I think is like the one person who I'm sure will like move if you get in his range. So I'm thinking like a spot here somewhere. Maybe like up here for now and see what happens. I This is really just figuring out their AI. And then, uh, see, you get doubled, Bartre. Yep, he gets doubled. Surely, by if we need to tank the enemy units, Queen is the one. She's yeah. the woman for the job, right? Like, obviously. You gotta, th you gotta think so. All right, we'll camp here for a second. Have Nino catch up. I guess we use the spirit like... dust. I guess so. Sure. She's uh, the fastest mage I have, I think. So might as well make her do more damage when she does double. I mean, Clearly it could be to Odin too, but here, yeah. you know, can't give everything to Odin. Only yeah, give no. half my resources to Odin. Forfeit all mortal positions to Odin. Forfeit half mortal possessions to Odin. <laughs> 19. Odin shows up, it's just tax season. Uh, Give me half your stat boosters. Uh, Ooh, he's doubles. Do what? it. All right, Geese. This is your time to shine. Take him out. One day he'll hit C rank axes. It's gonna Ooh. be so good. And he dodged too. And the dot, dude, what a king. Look at him go. Yes! C rank axes. I, dude, I just oh, looked man. at the stats, so like exactly the same as when he joined, bro. Oh, <laughs> yeah, basically. I mean, his base level was like 9, I think. Maybe 10? I want to say it's ten? 9 or 10. It, it should be the same as Disney Vanilla. And, and Vanilla, okay, Vanilla, if he's 6, he can definitely like mm -hmm. promote straight away, right? So, mm -hmm. I'm actually, am I misremembering? I don't know. I remember like just looking at his character sheet and there's just a million 9s. <laughs> yeah. Like, every number is a 9. Basically. Even his EXP. How'd that yeah. happen? Like, I think he just barely gained EXP on the way, didn't get deployed a whole lot, and then this is where he ended up. Uh, we got a armor knight. I wonder if this armor knight is separate. Does this have like they all called Arcanea, so I guess we don't know if they move. Because I'm pretty sure this group just cannot sneak through a horse group until this guy is gone. Yeah. Or if we just walk past him. I'm like, okay, what if we did just walk past him? All right? How bad would that be? Well, it wouldn't be bad for the right group with Marth, because you know they're already past them basically. But I kind of want the other people to be able to do more in this chapter than sit here and look at Horus's amazing portrait. Oh, true. So, I would like to go buy them, if I can. Like, I want to do stuff with Walt, come on. Right, oh, so true, true. Village. What's in the village? <laughs> Dorian Empire, what if we just, like, killed Horus? Just, like, bulldozed through this guy, right? He's protecting the villagers. Oh, well, we're gonna kill Lance. Yay! Okay, what the heck, what? Now we can kill things. Brilliant. Wait a minute, think? there's a... There's a dragon over there. Okay. Yeah, that's why we brought Rutger, because of this kind of stuff. <laughs> oh no. He's a little that scary. Was the dragon pike or? He's, yeah, I uh, no, Rutger is has the worm slayer, but basically yes. I see, I see. How do, how does the dragon pike do against that guy actually? Oh good question. Never really like looked at this weapon. It's effective, but it also misses a lot, so Yeah, it's not very good. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. It's alright. Let's go check out some forts. Are they like what we're we talking about here? For turn five, so in three turns, will it be just like four pirates coming from all these forts, or is it uh, different, different? Let me find out exactly what, because there's like a weird pattern to it, right? Mm -hmm. So there's a pirate from C on turn eight, and C is the lowermost section of forts, is what Wad says. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wad says that eight and ten comes from C, the, the lower fort, and then 10, 12, and 14, they come from B, which is like the middle forts, and then... 12, 14, 16, they come from A. Really late reinforcements here, huh? Yeah. Uh, looks like this armor knight does not want to move. I wonder what happens if I attack. Uh, but I kind of don't want to... I would. I would, I don't hate spending this save point here, but I would hate to have force move. I'm sorry, that was my email. That's not yours. I'm sorry, I forgot to turn it off. Okay, so... Golly, so, uh, so many notifications. Man. I know, I keep doing it too. Okay, it's fixed. It's fixed. I guess I can walk Rutger through the save point and see what happens and just kind of... Plop him on it. He's only gonna get attacked by well, calves and armor knights. It's not yeah, just great. plop on it. Not not save, just like sit him on the point, right? And then if he dies, just load the previous save point, I guess. Yo, oh, yeah, that's <laughs> the idea. Like, why why would you want to like save if you're like I'm not sure if he's gonna live here, right? I mean, since the enemies didn't move when we moved put Titania here, there's no way to move for Rutger if we put him here, right? Well, maybe. Oh, there? Yeah, no, no way. I mean, maybe here because he's gonna be in attacking range of this armor knight, which might change things. Yeah, 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 that might change things. Here, here for sure, that's safe. Okay. Gotta be, right? I mean, he's gotta be fighting the Manakeed anyway, so might as well move him there. Mm -hmm. And then Marf's gotta go to the village, so I guess we might as well move him here. Sounds good to me. 
And then we need to at some point like deliver maybe a better. What if Marth killed this uh, horse boss? Right? Imagine with like the regal blade. Uh, I mean, he does have the speed to not get doubled. We need someone to take care of the sniper. I was planning to have that be Titania, mm. but Titania is in a bit of a awkward spot. Yeah, no, you're right. I don't have warp on her either. So everyone's like separated. If we can like get Nino in there, does Nino live the sniper? Uh, that's 26. I think that's like exact Oko. I think if we heal her to full and get an HP level up or something, she lives. But uh, until then, nope. It's a lot of hopium in that state. Yeah, it's a lot of it's doing a lot of work in there. I almost want to try like the I here and just sitting. That could be funny to do. Although, I mean, it's in Horus' range. There's no way it's going to work. Yeah, I know. Horus, you're so annoying. I think I have to, might have to loop like Titania back around and then maybe warp her up to where the boss is. Soon. Everybody's just wheeling. Yeah, I mean, maybe not everyone. But these people can eventually fight pirates, right? At least. I but guess so, yeah. I don't know what this armor is going to do. I mean, he sits still, perfectly still, apparently. So yeah, maybe he won't he do it. He doesn't move. We do have to find out some like guy to assassin to assassinate the sniper, though. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, which I think Tatiana is like the main person for the job. Rutger can bait him, and then we can gank him, I guess, because it is a sniper. So that's also mm -hmm. an option. I think I would be willing to have like Geese sit on the peak and see that test that armor AI a little bit more. Sure. I think that would be okay to do. Move some other people up. Move Nime okay. towards where Titania is, so she doesn't have to walk all the way. I really do okay. think we ought to try and get that Regal Blade over. Like, I understand that means that Ike is probably doing nothing this chapter, but I feel all like right. a... All right, Titania, please deliver my Regal Blade. Here you go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, just go here, I guess. And let's sit geese on the... Oh, we can't. What kind of pirate cannot walk on peaks? Come on. Well, geese can. That's one. Like, in this game and his own. What do you mean? <laughs> huh? But he, he doesn't, though. Oh, yeah. He can't do it in his original game either, right? So. Oh, I guess he needs to promote first, is what you're saying. That's yeah. true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, true, true, true. I was, I, I, I was really going to contest that one, Mecca. Like, mm -hmm. what kind of pirate can't walk on, them? like, peaks? Like, true. I don't know, all of them? I was confusing with a mountain, because these are all peaks. And normally in FE6, this would be a mountain, this would be a peak. Oh, true, yeah. I yeah, guess. yeah, that, that odd one out would be, like, the mountain top. Yeah. Yeah, no, you're right. Oh, sheesh, that's actually kind of bad. Yeah, I think this? we just make him go at us in an uh, in open space, and then we two-shot him with the Worm Slayer. That's true. Like, just do this, and have Geese take the safe point, and hope it works out. I think so, sure. Let's try it out through the other save slots, so that if it's terrible, then we have ways back. We have the way back machine? Yeah, the way back machine. And I guess if they do start moving, then it would be okay to have some bait here, like Queen. Like, say, uh, Cav starts moving and wants to fight. That's right, yeah, we can draw them out of position with... Our queen. Queen. Let's see what happens. Yeah, and something funny happened. You know, hmm, no, this, this should be okay. This should be okay. All right, they're fighting. Now what? Scrapping. Ooh, mana keats with 3% crits. Don't do it. Don't do it. Thank you. Ooh, okay. Get him, Rutger. We're still alive. He lives. And nothing else happened. Horus is still okay, chilling. Nice. What if he just never moves? We're just like tricking ourselves into making the chapter difficult for ourselves. We're just getting like super pranked, yeah. Yeah. All right, Rutger, get him. From the forest for safety, I guess. Right? Yes, yeah, very safe. Could, I mean, it could go wrong, right? Like, I could have like moved Marth in his position to give support to Rutger because, you know, it's Cedar's replacements. Oh, true, yeah. But hey, we got a good level up out of it, so it was a good play all along. That's right, yeah. Uh, clearly, this armor knight doesn't do anything, so we're safe here. Let's. Do we take care of the sniper now? Just warp into Tanya now? Just warp it in. I mean, like, we can just walk to Tanya in, right? Like, how bad can it be? I mean, it just takes a couple turns, but sure. That's true. Right. I mean, like, a couple turns is what Martha's gonna need, right? So. <laughs> yeah, probably true. Uh, I guess we physic Rutger, because he's. There's gotta be something that goes wrong with him at some points. If nothing That's happens true. here, we might as well get ourselves ready for some uh, some pirates. They're going to be arriving this turn, right? Yeah, turn 8. So bottom? That's right. Like here and yes. here? No, 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 no. Uh, here, the, here? Just that one. Just that one? Just, just the bottom one. Yes, uh, the bottom one for it. 
Uh, and next turn, we're going to get some more some more variety. That's right. Well, it's going to be from the center forts. Well, the queen can take them all, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. And... I mean, clearly... Clearly. Mm, nope. <laughs> nope. Right? Okay, oh yeah, this just doesn't work. Okay, I do need this archer, which... Oh, wait. Oh! These are Arcanea, but these are Grust. Hold up, hold up. Okay. Changes things? I mean, that tells me that I think this guy belongs to Horus's group, but this guy doesn't, so we can bait out this guy separately. Oh, ooh, easy. This guy's separate too. Yeah, okay, so that's sniper. Good old deduction. A little bit. I think he should be fine. Geese does not get doubled by sniper, or Geese does he get doubled by totally sniper? He totally gets doubled by the sniper, but he's not in range. Okay. Of the sniper. He's, uh, he's in range of the horse troops. They don't move, it seems, so it should be fine. Seems good to me. Help, Zero Horus. All we can do is rest. A magic tome. Yeah, yeah, blizzard. blizzard. Whoa. Whoa, it's a tome I've never used. Very entertaining mm -hmm. spell, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> uh, is that for fine? I think he needs one more. No, he's fine. He survives the sniper right now with 22. Yeah, yeah. Seven. Yeah, he's fine. We don't need to visit him. All right, pirates. Bring it on. Not all at once, please. Show me your best pirate. <laughs> Steel guy guard. He's doing Oh, it. he's better than our best pirate, so you know. <laughs> ouch, ouch, ouch. Well, he is. Yeah. Like, I don't know. And so now it's going to be from here, 2Ds? That's right. Okay. And the bottom as well. Okay. Well, yeah. I guess I think she can two shot with silver. 25, 26, probably. 26, 19. Yeah, looks good. Let's get it. Looks like it. The epic duel. Let's go. And you all want some uh, some heals, more thanny damage, and we can sneak Kay. you past to help gank the sniper. And the sniper highlight range is highlighted right now, so we should be safe to move through here. Bring in Rutker. I guess we don't actually have the guy like in position to bait, huh? No, not yet. Titania will also be there next turn, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Golly. Beautiful. I just hope that Horus doesn't generally decide, hey, I should attack people. Yeah, no, like, you know what? Now's the time. Now is the time. He's just like, timed with the pirate reinforcements or something. That would be a good time to strike, I gotta say. Yeah, right? it, would be a, it would be a very iffy, loving thing to do. Yeah, queen! Just barely living the two shot. <laughs> Where's the friends? Next uh, turn? No, it's turn 10. Yeah, oh, okay. 8, eight 10. Even numbered turns. Even. That's right. Use a men for no reason. Oh, don't have a hand axe on him. It's fine. Jabalino. We just have like the epic characters just staring at each other awkwardly, like watching the men and a mission happen. It's like, this was not necessary. Why are reason the men? Steel bow! No way. With Walt? Get out of here. I thought we were feeding EXP to Gold Mary. I thought that was the agenda. I mean, she's ready to promote already. I need Walt Oh, that's true, that's true. He's level three. <laughs> yeah, he's level three. We gotta get the other seven levels too, right? So. Yeah. Go, Titania! Use hand axe. Titania, Titania. Get in there. Is this like her theme song? Mm. Yeah. I Go, don't... Titania. Use hand axe. Titania, Titania. It's like a... There was once a like early impressions review from Shadow Dragon by someone who said, mm -hmm. well, the characters are pretty cool, but they are a little bit generic, the way that they reclass and stuff. It makes me think mm -hmm. like they just, instead of having characters with like distinct characters instead, it's more like, go Jagan, use Bubble Beam, Jagan, Jagan. It's been living rent free in my head ever since. So every now and then oh, I recite really? it without realizing that no one knows what I'm reciting. <laughs> We got. I, I mean, now I got to see this video. It's like <laughs> it's not a video. It's just a. It's just a piece of text. But it was as well written. Oh, I see. Um, okay, so Steel Boat is not one shot, you know. So we can do Irvin into Elfire. I hope so. Yes, that will work. And you know, it's totally fine, right? Twenty HP, fine. Yes, she's fine. Okay. Oh, pff. pathetic enemy, man. Look Get at in that. there. Guided enemies, my beloved. Oh, that a crit. That a crit, I think. No, just a normal animation. I don't know. If Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I've never played this game before. I don't know what the animations do. 
from Fume Image, you know, and a heap of EXP. What the heck? Yep. That was like 80 hey. XP. We can and this to someone else for sure. <laughs> <laughs> You'll wait. It's a good thing we didn't use that, right? Yep. Uh, oh, no HP, though. Dang, we don't live that sniper anymore. <laughs> anymore. You have no more chance of living the sniper until the next level up. Uh, mm -hmm. Well, this looks like another easy feed for the squad here. Uh, nothing on 11, right? Just even turns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the even turns. I guess these guys are kind of like approaching our position now, right? So yeah, I guess maybe... the middle group kind of has to do something. Yeah, maybe we can like send Queen or Ike to one of them and keep the other one here. That sounds good. Uh, Ike is not like fantastic, but he'll weaken the enemy. Which is good, because that means we can kill him afterwards. If we can't feel, we can true. always like... If we can't route them, we can always move backwards or something. There's there's options here. Move our five move, five move archer out of the way just in case. Yeah, should be good. That's right, we might get outranged. A little bit. Oh, um, supports. <laughs> you know, double sis, right? Like, no way she doesn't. She's like 16 speed right now. Every yeah, time. Yeah, get in there. Mm. Simple as. You know, so good. Here comes she's a, she's the best mage in two games now. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Ruffian. Get hiked. Killing Edge? No way. I want to promote him next, kind of. I want to see Hero Ike in action. Oh, sure, yeah, he goes to Hero. He goes is to he the like, Urban. Well, like, I mean... Is he like the only replaced Mark that we have? Besides, like, Caesar, who's not replaced? Uh, you know, good... No, no, there's Alm, right? Oh, yeah, Alm. <laughs> I forgot about him after one chapter already. He's so... I know, yeah. So slow. Very, very loyal to your man Alm here. Uh-huh. Uh, uh hold on. oh. I mean, I still haven't had the chance to use Stanitos or anything. Maybe I'll kill like one of Horus's troops when the chapter's about to end. Oh no! And it turns out this just like makes Horus <laughs> <Yeah>. not recruitable. <laughs> like you killed one of my guys. The, the Shima you know? problem. Oh yeah, yeah. Can you kill from here with Parthia? He can. What a what a beast. What a Chad. Go Walt. Using Parthia to kill dangerous fires? No, 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 no. <laughs> Feed and Walt like 40 EXP on a Gaiden. Drake. That's Yo, what the level ups the though. Use. These are just this vanilla growth, remember? He's, he's doing that's good. That's right. He's doing good. I mean, they look like it's vanilla growth. <laughs> okay, Micaiah, heal Ike. Take all the power I have. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> and so the pirate will come down. I don't know how to bait that pirate, that armor knight or that cavalier over since horse clearly isn't moving. Maybe we bait horse from the top and then the wrestle move? I don't know. I'll find something. I mean, maybe. Maybe. We could, like, kill the boss first just to just secure to... it, right? Just to... Okay, hold up. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. Okay. If we can sneak into that range with Micaiah, then we can totally own one of the armor knights and then, kill, and then seize. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, so we don't have much in the way of horse slaying here. We have the Regal Blade here, I guess. That's kind of good. Like you said, Marth is able to do the job. I guess we could have Nime take the Regal Blade and convoy it. That's right. Convoy the Regal Blade, keep the warp actually, and then heal Nino. He'll need a full. Can Nino like get in there at all? Wait, he doesn't even have to. Yeah, do he's he's a scrub. I just realized too. What is this guy? Yeah, I was like, surely he has a javelin, right? Vexation. <laughs> <laughs> I'll skewer you like rabbits. This game is so much flavor in the text. Alright, the question is do I feed Marth though? I, think I mean, the, the thing is, like, the Regal Blade it, is it's safe, right? Cause it's pretty safe. Uh, I think Geese would get doubled if you went up close. Yep. Yeah. Classic. I mean, it's pretty safe. Alright, Marth, fine. You can have the boss kill just this one time. Uh, if we get hit, though, we're kind of screwed. But we have backup could, in Titania, so it's probably fine. We could just attack with, like, something and then... Legal Blade! Also, we could just sit, right? Like, oh, mm. Yeah, maybe just sit. <laughs> maybe we just sit. It's right. the same either way, right? So let's just sit. <laughs> Gently <laughs> poke him, just in case. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on, geese. Rutger gets two shot, too, so... I mean, I guess having Rutger sit isn't that too bad, either. He does 10. Marth kills I though. guess, having him sit. Yeah. But if you just, like, use Leaven Sword to attack from a distance. Oh. I mean, we're never actually breaking this Leaven Sword, right? <laughs> oh, <laughs> never mind. Okay. It's a good reason not to do it. Yeah. <laughs> so. 
Okay, let's stay outside of Horus' range here. And just wait one tick. And it's an even turn, so we're going to see more, some more pirates this turn. That's right. Up fort. Middle fort. Uh, I see. I see. I'm beginning to see a pattern. There we go. That's the pattern. Oh, oh, dude, the double crit? I Is that Micaiah uh, Bond support? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Transferred from another game. Get a Marth. Oh, Marth. Oh, come on, Marth, dude. It's a good thing we didn't try. This is supposed to be the Mar yeah exactly. It just we let we let him have that one honestly. <laughs> we gave our brother the controller. That's what happened, you know. Like, He's using the Wii steering wheel. <laughs> All right, let's try to feed Nino then instead. It's more safe. That's true. Get in there with the Irvin. That just happens to look like Alliance. And then Nino with the Elfire. No Six way. Two hit hits every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You'll pay. You'll pay. Vexatious rebels, whatever it was that he said. Hey, right. Nino grows kind of fast. I don't know why people are saying this unit is bad. Hey, yeah, she's hey, getting in there. Yeah, Holy. She good what the heck, dude? <laughs> Growth unit confirmed. They're all getting up there? Yeah, they're all getting up there. Okay, we need to, like, we wanted to get Thanny position to just, like, terrorize an Armanite or something. Was yeah. that the plan? I mean, my save mm -hmm. is like 15 years ago. I'm really scared about putting Makai in range of something that can kill her. <laughs> Can I kill her though? I mean, it's only 29 attack. Or tw she has 29 one hit bulk, right? Yeah, true. Okay, actually, you're right. So we just put her at the edge of the Cavalier, and if that doesn't attack her, then we move in to kill the Armonite, basically, right? That's right. Can she actually move in to kill the Armonite though? I mean, does she have the movement? Yeah, so we'd be here. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Okay, we have six to it. I think. Yes. I'm pretty sure. That looks like six. Armonite can't reach Cav. Wait, the Cavalier has 23, Lamal. Okay, this, this is only a range of that mm -hmm. one guy. Yeah, Micaiah is fine. This, this is really just a Rainy Dawn experience. It's like, is Micaiah really fine? Is she really able to survive this really one fine? enemy? I mean, is it though? I mean, look at, look at these stats on this unit. It's actually kind of a oh boy. I've never seen a Micaiah this large. Big Micaiah. Picky Mickey. Whoa. And then watch like the AI, like the pirate just blocks completely. Yeah, well, in that case, we have some characters nearby that can help, right? Oh, true. Is the idea. All right, get in there and help. Get in there, Gordon. Or Walt. I Gordon Ramsay. Yeah. And then... Okay, so we want this calf to go down, so we don't really want to bait him like that. So let's just sit here. I think so. Okay, they didn't do anything, so it's time for the Thanitos. All right, Horace, will you join me if I just nuke one of your friends? Here it goes. Benny toes. Yo, and the crit. And it freezes. <laughs> wow. Wow. We should have thought of that. Maybe we should have. <laughs> well. <laughs> <laughs> 153 damage. Game couldn't. Uh, yeah, game, game couldn't, couldn't handle it. it. That's right. That's right. Okay, let me just reset the ROM real quick. Sorry. Right. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll just skip the thing. No, fuck. Hold up. No, Wait, no, no. What? Hold up, hold up, hold up. No. No. What happens if we just load the save? I mean, then we just start from the save point. No, no, no. I mean the, the save state. Oh, yeah. This happens. Ah, uh, it's still frozen. Hmm. All right, we won. <laughs> GG's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Trust, trust Chapter's me. Chapter's over. Bye. <laughs> All right, yeah, see ya. <laughs>